Today what I have for you is a remote controlled shopping system. So this uses potions for controls and I'll you'll understand the controls but I'll explain them. So speed potions mean on off, weakness means scroll and slowness means select. So we're in this abandoned tower, we want to get up there but the ladder's broken, we're hungry and there is a zombie down here and we don't have a weapon. So let's use our shop to solve this puzzle. Okay, so we're going to open the shop with the speed potion. The shop is now open. So like I said, weakness scrolls, so we go at that. Weaponry selected, uh, material selected, food selected. Uh, let's say we want weaponry because we want to get rid of that zombie first. So once the weaponry is selected, we're going to confirm with the slowness potion. Okay, opened weaponry. So what have we got in here then? We have a stone sword is selected, that costs five experience. Then we've got an iron sword for 15 and we've got a diamond sword for 30 xp so let's go for the let's go for the iron one so go on the iron one we click select we get 15 levels taken away and we get the iron sword so let's deal with him okay so we don't want to eat that rotten flesh so let's go into our shop system to get some food so let's uh, see what we've got available we've got weaponry selected materials uh, food so let's open food okay opened foods so what kind of foods we've we got we've got one watermelon we've got steak and we have cake so let's go for the cake because we have enough experience for it okay so we get the cake the the food is been the food section has been closed and we can just eat some of that lovely so finally we need to be able to repair this wall somehow so let's once more go into the shop, weaponry, let's go into materials, let's open that up, okay, open materials, what have we got in here, we've got, we've got torches, times 10, that costs 10 XP, we have a working bench, and we also have a ladder, so let's get the ladder, because that's the obvious choice, that costs 5 XP, so let's select that, okay, so we've got our ladders, and there we go, so let's turn the shop off now, because we don't need it. Okay, the shop is now closed, and now we can just place these down, go up here, and collect our marvellous treasure in here. So, as expected, this uses command blocks to work. Um, now, this actually is based on a similar idea to the player scanner. So, that is, the, but this uses potion effects. So, that this effect basically uh, clears a player of fire resistance. But you'll notice that the com this comparator isn't going off and the reason for that is because I don't have fire resistance on me so if I do have fire resistance it will send a short pulse so basically we can connect there detect um, if someone has a specific potion effect on them so I'm not going to go into too much depth just skim past it all so what this does is we use a swiftness potion and that will activate this clock uh, system well not a clock system but basically what we've got here we've got weaponry we have materials and we have foods so the weakness potion will scroll through these so you'll see weaponry materials and finally foods so once you're actually happy with your selection you want to confirm it with the slowness potion there we go and that will trigger a next uh, second clock which will go into a sub category um, and from here we can select the um which item we actually want to buy so we've got watermelon we have steak and we have cake and then we confirm and then that's selected and we get the, the thing the points are reducted and um, the system resets itself so it doesn't actually turn off it just goes back to the um, the, uh, the main menu so you can select some more stuff um, and if you want to turn it off that then you can just do that with a a swiftness potion now the reason I got the uh, swiftness potion so the on off switch is basically so um, that because obviously this sort of renders po those potions unusable in a map so like this you can actually use these freely you can use these freely without them doing anything if you've turned the shop system off so the only one that you can never really properly use is this swiftness potion but obviously you'd actually use a more useless potion in that place if you liked this loved this hated it or would just like to complain about something then let me know with a rating a comment or even a subscribe you can also follow my Twitter for inane posts and reliable upload notifications. I hope you enjoyed this video and I'll see you next time.